Well, good damn afternoon, Americans. Jericho Green here with you once again. Make sure you get to my green gear. Mm. Dot com. Check out all the new merch I got there. So there was another mass shooting. And just like all the other mass shootings, it's terrible. There were seven people who were shot. Two of them killed. Now, of course, when people lose their lives to such senseless, senseless violence, it is terrible. But I think this is a little extra terrible because the two victims were a father and his stepson who was graduating. An 18-year-old young man who went to that school and the 36-year-old stepfather who came to support him, they were both gunned the fuck down. Now, you're probably sick and tired of hearing about this story. You know their names. You know where they are from. The victims' faces are everywhere. They're plastered on every screen, on every TV, on the side of buses. You see the press conferences. You are just sick and tired of hearing... Hold on a second. I get my producers in my ear. Yeah, man, what's up? I'm doing a video. Of course you know I'm doing a video. You're my producer. What's up? Yeah, it was mass shooting. Seven people shot, two killed. It was terrible. It's not? Why? Oh, that, yeah, okay. That makes sense. That's a, Yeah, it's fucked up, but that's how it always is. Okay, let me get back to my video. Appreciate it. Sorry about that, guys. You know, sometimes a producer, when I say something that's incorrect, he'll get in my ear and be like, whoa, 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 hold on, Jericho. So my bad, I lied. Um, you don't know about this shooting. You don't know the victims, and you haven't seen their face everywhere. Why? Because the shooter was the same damn color as the victims. That's right. Black shooter, black victim. Let me check the mainstream mediocres. Give a shit meter. Uh, barely moving the needle. White shooter, black victim, <laughs> ding, 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 ding. Black shooter, black victim. That's right. You're not going to hear about this shit. You're not going to hear any about the, you're not going to hear the empty suit politicians talking about comprehensive gun reform. Kamala Harris isn't going to go down there and ga 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 into a microphone in front of the populace. She's not going to do that. They are not going to do that. Why? Because the colors just, it just didn't. If some crazy white fucker went to a black high school graduation and started a gunning down negras, are you kidding me? All the race pimps would be deployed. Al Sharpton, Ben Crump, Joy Reid. All you empty suit sons of bitches get down there and make a big deal because we finally what we've been wishing for. A cisgender, Christian, racist, Trump supporting white man has shot some black people. But nope, that didn't happen. Just another wild ass Negro shooting black folk. And both of those men were young men, 18 and 36. That 18 year old, that boy had his whole life in front of him. As, as you know, as an adult over, say, 30, you know that life doesn't even begin until you step off that high school campus. You have all the potential in the world. You can do whatever you want. You're in America, son. Whatever you want to be, whatever you want to do, you have the world by the tail, but not anymore. His stepfather, you would get to sit there and watch this young man become a grown man and have children of his own. You could be grandpa one day. And you could have your son come to you and say, Dad, I'm so glad that you did A, B, and C. I'm so glad that you didn't let me do this. I'm so glad that you came to my graduation. But none of those moments will ever happen. Because some wild, savage son of a bitch thought it was a good idea to shoot a gun at a high school graduation. Now, what are they going to call this? Gun violence. Because it's the gun. The gun is the source of the carnage. If we could only get those damn guns out of the way, all the violence would stop. All this inner city bullshit would stop. You know, this reminds me of a statistic that I heard a long time ago. 193 countries in the world, when it comes to mass shootings, 
which I guess is four or more people shot and or killed. I think that's what they're going by. America is number three. Out of 193 countries, we are number three. So, of course, everything the left told us, America is violence. It's a gun culture. They were right. We're in the top three. Unless you take out all the top five violent cities in America. If you take them out of the equation, we drop down to 189. Don't believe the hype. Don't believe the bullshit. America is not overrun with gun violence. That's bullshit. These handful of Democrat-run shitholes where the gangbangers have card blanche like Chicago, America's shooting range, that's when the numbers go up. You take out those shitholes and we fall to 189. That's not too bad for a country with 325 million people in it. But unfortunately, this might be one of the very few places you hear about this mass shooting. But you best believe if it's a white boy or some crazy ass white Ku Klux trans member, then you'll hear about it. That is what we call some bullshit. But you know how it goes. I try to be done with the left, but they just won't let me. Please subscribe. Hit that notification bell because every time it rings, a piece of shit lefty cries. Utilize the link tree link. Get your ass over to JerichoGreen.net and MyGreenGear.com. I am Jericho Green. Man, I'm out.